stencils are a great addition to an art practice. I use them all the time. They're fabulous where you need really hard edges with your texture paste. You can get the soft, squishy stuff with your palette knife, but for a hard edge, you need a stencil. These ones, these are scrapbooking stencils, and they're okay. They tend to come in formal patterns, and they tend to be a bit too flexible, a little bit flimsy. They're not really designed to be worked with texture paste. And I don't know, I find I break them. So the other thing is, those formal patterns, while I use them, they're not always the thing that I want. And there was this wonderful thing. When I was in Lonfeston teaching one time, one of the students came up with this cobweb tape, which was absolutely marvellous. And this is my last little piece of it. And I used the cobweb tape and my stencil cutting machine together. And I came up with this stencil here, which I've had for a long time now, and I love it. It's fantastic for foliage. But it's also a little bit flimsy and just not, oh, it's just not enough. And then Graham found a man with a laser cutting machine and what he's done for us is made these beautiful stencils. They're thick, acrylic, they're really sturdy, they're big, they're small, they're in the middle, they're everything you need them to be and I need them to be for making foliage. And I'm going to show you exactly how to use it. Okay, I have some texture paste here that I've mixed with Naphthol Red Light, Naphthol Crimson and some Diox Purple because I've been working on this painting and what I want to make happen is some berries on the palm fronds. So I have my stencil right here down on the surface and I'm going to pick up some texture paste from all my different colours and holding the stencil down because I really don't want it to move, I'm just going to come across really simply, you use a big knife to do this and I'm making sure my shape has a fairly ragged edge because we're talking about the berries on palm fronds, there's not a lot of regularity there and just a little bit more up into there And then, when I pull it up, I have some berries. Isn't that next level amazing? <laughs>